As far as the president of the Trinidad and Tobago Unified Teachers Association and her executive is concerned, all teachers will be reporting for duty come Monday, January 17th, regardless of vaccination status. Utah President Antonio De Freitas said there is no written legislation or policy regarding the vaccination requirements in the education system and therefore no action can be taken. We cannot presume to say or do anything. And we are aware that there are one or two schools, principals who, being overzealous, have declared their schools as safe zones and are demanding that. And we are calling on those principals to cease and desist because, as I said, as yet, there is nothing in writing on this particular matter. So we can't presume anything. We can't discuss anything. Ms. Freitas said there are procedures within the public sector regulations which must be followed. She said that the concept of furlough is not one which exists in their jurisprudence. As we know, they are to continue reporting for duty unless direct, directed in writing to not do so. Right? That's the procedure. At a press conference in December 2021, Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley announced that government workplaces will require vaccinated staff by mid-January 2022.